there had been a time in American history, it wasn't very long ago, when the United States had a bestiary of animals that had drawn people from all over the world. Herds of 20 to 30 million bison, millions of horses roaming the American Great Plains. Grizzly bears drawn to the Great Plains as a result of the bison herds. There were, of course, gray wolves, the keystone predator of the Great Plains. There were pronghorn antelope, a survivor creature from the Pleistocene extinctions. There were elk and bighorn sheep and mule deer, and of course, coyotes. We wiped almost all of them out in this, this massive destruction of wildlife. I wasn't able to find another analogy of this kind of destruction of wild animals anywhere in world history. And we did it here in the United States in a century's time, and we hardly remember a thing about it. We had almost completely exterminated bison, almost completely eradicated gray wolves, had dwindled grizzly bears down to a few hundred bears and had driven them off the Great Plains into the Rocky Mountains to hide and done the same with elk and had killed all the bighorn sheep on the plain. As I realized the truth of this, this remarkable and sort of lost story about wild animals in America, one of the things I also realized was that the one animal that survived all of this was the coyote.